Previously on Factions. Yeah, what have, what have you brought to the table, my friend? We ended up getting the name back. Do it. Got it. Can we move into the main part or a box? We're gonna raid this base, dude. Aftermath is gonna fall. Look at all the gear he dropped. I just e pearled into a chest. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Home F, and we can store our gear in here. Hey, what's up, guys? The Camper Rusher here. Welcome back to Factions. First off, I'm gonna be a little bit quiet during this episode. One of the not perks, not perks, disadvantages of university is there's a quiet time and I am way past that quiet time and I don't want to get in trouble from my roommate friends and not roommates, but, but, uh, hallmates, I guess. Either way though, don't let that distract you. We've got an epic episode planned for you this, this time. Seriously, in about, in about a minute or two, you guys are going to see probably one of the be I I say the best base that we have ever built throughout the 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 span of this faction show. Uh, not just this season, in all. This base, I just saw it, is amazing. And I guess this is your surprise. So last episode, Napkin returned. And we did some epic fights. If you missed that episode, it was such a fun episode to film. Huge battle, huge raid. And it was on Faction's Green. It was pretty awkward. The, the base, I did a base tour on. We, we messed it up. And had a had an epic fight to get in there, but today is the big announcement. While Napkin's been gone, he's actually been working very hard in the factions world, as many of you guessed. Napkin, even though you you did have some real life things that that wasn't a lie, but you can't you can't avoid the factions world. Let's be honest, factions uh, along with me, it's it's a part of our lives, dude. It's it's encrypted into our soul, and you. You worked hard on something, dude, and do you, do you want to give the official announcement here on what it is? Uh, yeah, we built the, the V4. The Goliath V4. The Goliath is a series of bases that have been been produced by the Team Nudist faction. Since, when did Goliath... Was that when we were Rumble. fighting? Rumble started the Goliath. When was it? Yeah. Three... Oh, it must have been Wolf. four. Four? So the base at the end of last season, Ep 600, was not Goliath. It was even before that. It was during last season. So it has been over 100 episodes since the last version of Goliath. And that was VND. That was a special version. Goliath 3 was, oh my god, probably almost two seasons ago. So the return of the Goliath franchise, Goliath V4, is tonight. And in my opinion, and I think everyone's opinion in this call, it's the best base we've ever built. Just to give proper credit, of course, Napkin, you took on the outside of the base completely, or did you have a little bit of help? What was it? Uh, no, mostly, mostly me and Wild, but a couple others helped. Okay, yeah. so yeah, they killed it on the outside, and different than usual, Caboose took on the whole inside. Caboose has been a member of ours for a while, and apparently he's got some artistic skills. Get ready. I'm so excited. We're going to show you this thing. It's huge. The Goliath V4. But I'm going to make you wait a second. Daily Factions comment of the day coming in from <laughs> Kyler Simser. When will there be new tags? I really want new ones. Heart. And I chose this comment because it's very fitting for this weekend. This weekend, we've got some really good tags coming out for you. I've been compiling different tags, different ideas based on your guys' comments, suggestions, and my, my, my ideas as well. And I got a few releasing this weekend. Some really good ones I think you're going to enjoy. I know I'm going to enjoy one in particular. So get ready for that. You should see those on Friday. Thank you for your comment, Kyler. You seem like a decent guy. Now, for the epic event, the epic showing. I'm so excited to show you guys this slash home F. The Goliath V4. Let's show it off, baby. Welcome to the Goliath V4. This thing is massive. So initially, again, keep in mind, Caboose has what has he hand built hand built this basically himself, right? Just just oh, yeah. him? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty like, much. Yeah, just him. He's been doing it for. Uh, I think we've been starting on this a week. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. Keep in mind, guys, this has been going on for a week, week plus. Well, while Napkin's been you know gone ish, he's been in charge of this, and the boy's been working very hard. This thing, at first glance, look how massive it is. Do you guys remember usually our old space? Like, there's room for a thousand people in here. I mean, I don't want to have a battle in here because that means we, we lose this base. 
but it's massive. Like it's almost takes takes my breath away just walking across this thing. Uh, we have tons of room for storage. This is the obviously the storage room, and Caboose is still working hard at this. But the design itself in here is very nice, very open, very massive. Lots of people can fit in here, in and lots of chests specifically. Now. As we go up the staircase, some of my favorite parts of this base is, are, are, is the, of this base is the staircase. You can see this here, obviously a staircase. Now get ready for this part. This is my favorite part. Leading up, we got wooden pillars. What's up, Wild? What's up, Vans? Another secondary area here. Do we know what we're doing with this area yet, Wild? Oh, Vans, oh, back geez. off, buddy. Uh, no, I think this is just underneath the iron golem spawner, so nothing really. No. No, nothing really yet. And you guys can see, oh, there it is. There it is. This thing is massive. I gotta eat a gaffle here. So we go around. There is our IG spawner. And this is actually very... Uh, very critical this IG spawner being so massive and so profitable because we're going to need a lot of money for the upcoming 20 days of faction seriously we need tons of cash for the plans that we have uh, I won't let you know now but like I've said before episode 700 is on the way and we have a lot to do before then and on that day and it's going to cost a lot of cash here's all the building materials they're using but here we go check this out it's a huge staircase and it's like a heaven and hell theme. You can see it's like morphed into each other. We can watch the IGs. There will be hundreds of IGs up there once we get going. Actually, Vert in our faction I think has over $100 million in the bank apparently. Is that true? Yeah. Yeah. I think he's at 112 million now. Yeah, he is loaded. So we are going to have tons of IGs up there and the staircase right here is just epic, man. And right here is where it turns from red glass to bluish and it morphs into it slowly to the stone brick to the quartz and you go from the bottom which is hell into the top which is heaven. Such a cool build. Not only the, the sheer size of this base is crazy, just the the design itself. I, I, I love it dude. I'm in love with this freaking base dude. I'm so proud of you bros. This is this is the Goliath V4. You guys know if we do another Goliath, like it has to live up to the Goliath name. This is this is the trademark base. I actually haven't been up here yet. What is our plan? Obviously, we're gonna have AFK machines up here. What's our plan for the very top? Any wild? Do you know? No idea. No idea. Maybe, we get... I think there might be protected chests up here. Protected yeah, chests. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So this will be maybe our our better loot will be up here with the the water chests, etc. Oh no no no! I think we're building a hotel actually. So like everyone has their own little room. Wait, the all the mods or different? Yeah, all, yeah, the mods. All the, the mods, mods. Okay, and we yeah. may and we may below add trusted uh, boxes after. So we're building a hotel up here. A hotel within the base, guys. This is the Goliath V4. If you're excited as I am, touch that like button. I'm going to go show you around the outside. I am, I'm in love, dude. Vems, I like this base more than I like you. What the heck, dude? <laughs> I what? know. Are you freaking just... serious? <laughs> I'm up, just man? playing, man. Up, man. Yeah, there you go. There no, you dude, you put that down, dude. <laughs> you don't even joke about this, dude. Um, and now, now that you see me, the, the, in, the inside, and of course more is coming, we are going to take a peek at the outside. I've jumped into Slash Fly to give you a better look, starting out with Bat Dad. Of course, with Napkin in charge of the exterior, he gets to put his clip art. <laughs> Batman with a napkin face. Do you see? That's why I called you Dad uh, last episode, Napkin. Is this reason? That was still creepy as hell. <laughs> Sorry, we're brothers. <laughs> or lovers. Uh, uh, okay, maybe. so... <laughs> guys, what is cool about this base as well, this is the first corner. We're in the overworld, by the way. It is the first corner from episode one of this season. If you guys have been around this long, or if you want to go check it out, episode one of this season, do you remember we ended up killing and death banning the people who had the corner claim? We had like iron gear on, etc. We killed them, overclaimed them, and then made a deal with them and took over that corner. Well, 78 episodes later, or whatever we are on, I always miss it by a day or two, we now have the Goliath V4 in that area, which it's so weird to think how things work out and how fast this season has went by. Uh, as for the walls themselves, not as much protection as usual. Hey, Napkin, I, 
I, I feel like we we haven't really needed all the protection we've used because the one time we were raided with a cannon is because they they started within the claim somehow because we we unclaimed a little bit. But you can see these are our walls here, still around 50 walls or so, eh, Napkin? Yeah, I think there's like 60. 60-ish, like and then corner pillars as well. And nothing, nothing insane here on the genning of the walls, but the sheer size of the base is massive. The claim must be pretty big too, eh? Yeah, it's uh, 20 chunks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah, it's a massive claim, that the max it could be. And that, my friends, Napkin's been still working on genning these walls. And that is the Goliath V4, I guess, after a week of building. There's still tons going on. If anyone comes near this base, I love it like a child already, and I just saw it. <laughs> I just saw it tonight. You guys just showed me tonight. I wasn't even able to see it. I knew about the plan, but I wasn't allowed to see it. If anyone even comes near this base, they will be death banned. I love this base already. I know Napkin does. He put a ton of time into it. Caboose obviously loves it. And <laughs> no one is getting through this thing. It will live till the end of this season. We could promise you that. And we will do everything we can. We will kill anybody we see in order to keep the Goliath V4 alive. Well, Napkin, you're back. And what else do you want to do on your second day back to the show? Raid another base. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and that's what we do. Today's a funny one, though. So here's the... There's always a story, I feel like. There's always a story, especially with these big raids where you pull out the big cannon and Napkin does a ton of work for it. Napkin, J. Bigsy, and the Salanthum faction, uh, previously known as 305, right? Yeah, 305 yeah. and part of Bad Rep, too. Part of Bad Rep. They kind of morph together. J. Bigsy, the day that Napkin left, if you guys remember, a week and a half, two weeks ago, we... They, they had walls, and we basically just destroyed the walls. We scattered them to make it ugly and gross and give them tons of things to do with their time and just wasted so many hours of their lives. And that was Napkin's goodbye message to them. He he really doesn't like Jay Bigsy. They've had a couple words said to each other. Actually, Napkin, what is the worst thing that Jay Bigsy has ever said to you? Uh, you really want me to say it? Yeah, no, I w yeah, say it, say it, say it. He told me to <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, oh dude. You asked me what he said. That is <laughs> terrible. That is absolutely, <laughs> I'm crying. That is so funny, dude. All right. Wow, this is a PG-rated show until that, dude. Oh <laughs> okay, that is funny. I'm gonna cry, dude. I don't know why you made me laugh so hard now. Okay, so... <laughs> Basically, he said some very rude and uncomfortable things to Napkin <laughs> that got under his skin and made me laugh my butt off. <laughs> or they so, could be comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, no. Okay, now let's focus. So, also with this base, it is the it's the base. They rebuilt the walls that we scatter cannon and actually made it into a base. They use the same thing. So now that Napkin's back. Two days later, we're going to actually raid this base. And it's just it's just the normal one shot, all right? Hybrid and break the wall in one shot. We should be in within 20 shots or so, right? Uh, actually, it's more like 60, but yeah. No, like 60. Is it 60 They got walls? a lot of walls. Yeah, they got a lot of walls. Yeah, I'll actually go show you guys quickly what's going on. Let me jump at Slash Fly, give you a good old look at this thing. Yeah, they got a bunch of walls on this bat. No, not 60. I'd say 30 to 40, yeah. So, nothing crazy, but they got the big S there. Actually, someone's, someone's AFKing there. I better not be in fly. And lots of corner pillars. They're still planning to gen a lot more. The plan's to get through this thing. It's very late for me right now, so we're going to go for it. And, yeah, Napkin, they said some very rude things to you, so <laughs> let's punish them for it, my friend. Napkin already doing some very good work here. Before we know it, as he blows through another one, we're through two... About 10 to 12 walls, you'd say, hey, Napkin? He's here. <laughs> look yeah. at him, dude. Look at him. Look at him. Looking so cute, dude. You're always multitasking. And, yeah. yeah, that's the plan. We're making good progress. You guys know the drill going through these walls. It gives Napkin great joy. It gives me great joy, honestly. But I think for this one, it's mostly Napkin. This guy has said some very rude things to him, as you heard in the last clip. <laughs> and there is one. Jay Big Z is in there, AFK. If we get in there, Napkin, I will allow I'm, you I'm, oh, to be yeah. the one to give him the death ban, all right? Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> all right, absolutely. I think, uh, yeah, we're probably about a quarter of the way there, ladies and gents. 
Hold on tight. It's going to be a wild ride. Wild ass. Wild. Uh. Well, I get it. Yeah. It's late at night, so I try to make a joke. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, I think oh, it worked. Oh, we're we in? We're we're in? We're Yes, I see base. Oh, I see base. Oh my god, I'm stuck in a fence. We were all silently <laughs> waiting for that shot to come in. <laughs> Are you actually I'm stuck in a fence? Oh, oh, oh wait, oh I, might, god, I have man. something. I have something. I'll get you out of there, buddy. I'll get you out of there, dude. Come here. Come slash here. kill? Oh. <laughs> slash kill, that too. All right, dude, get get your butt oh, out of there. there you need to go kill your boy, dude. Where Look is at, he? What is these blaze heads? I don't know. This uh, is creepy, though. These things are just this? staring at me. Um, oh, TNT. All right, get, grab the TNT, grab everything we can, but go kill. I want Napkin to kill this guy. Oh my God, look at all this TNT. I think he's upstairs. I hear Blade. Well, I, hear, uh, I hear Iron Golems. Okay, I don't want to be very selfish, but I'm taking this to my new bedrock vault. <laughs> oh my God, they have gear. Do they have tons? Yeah, look in here. Where are we? Where are we? Oh, they've got some of it blocked off, but these ones aren't. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm, I'm helmets, helmets. Normal. Oh, we hit the jackpot, uh, boys. We hit the jackpot. We hit the really? jackpot. <laughs> I can't freak out, obviously. Sorry if I'm sniffling, too. I'm a little bit sick. Uh, but it's pretty late at night, so I gotta be a little bit quiet. But baby girl, we got a lot of gear. Bring it back to the Goliath, and I'll bring some of it back to the good old uh, Bedrock Vault. Yo, that's not all, either. The, they Why would they keep these uncovered? I guess easy access to them or something. They've got booties in here. Give me that. Booties. They got pants. Booties. Oh, they, they got a full dub of chest plates. My God, if it wasn't 1 a.m. in the morning, I would be ooh, freaking out right now. Ooh. Oh, oh. Good. that kind of worked. Do it again. Do it again. Right. It, it went up. Yeah, there's water, so we should be able to float right up after this one. Because Napkin wants his freaking kill. I know he does. I know he up does. Up there somewhere. I, I see him spinning. Yeah, I, I lost him now, but he was higher up in the base for sure. Deposit my goods in the good old bedrock vault. Oop, I dropped uh, the wrong pair of boots in there. There we go. Oh, my God. This thing's already looking a little bit rich. Look at this, baby. Sorry, guys. I'm kind of hogging it for myself. Um, <laughs> no, there's, Dude. there's plenty of us, plenty of room to load up the Goliath as we go to, I'm, I'm hitting up the Brock vault. They're hitting up the, the Goliath V4. I was blowing my nose and napkin has blown through this first one. Oh my God. Look at all the blaze spawners here too. Oh, this you is probably creeper. Egg them all. It's so, Oh, I yeah. can actually, I can hit those. Oh, I can hit these. Well, you hit him, you hit him. Uh, wild. Do you have extra creeper eggs in your E chest? Oh, I hit bottom dollar. I do. Bro. Okay, good, good, good. We're going to need them. Um, All right, I'm gonna go get him from this chest. Oops! Oh, my bad. <laughs> that thing fell yeah. right out of there. I got one. Good I job. Good job. Did you pick oh, any up? I got like five. You did wait. Did you uh, pick no, any? No, no, I didn't get anything. Dang it! All right, uh, well, <laughs> we're basically screwed. <laughs> we don't have any well, more platforms. I just stole your spotlight. Oh, oh. I'm sorry. That's all right, man. That's all right. These things are ticking me out. Let's just slaughter the blazes. I'm more mad at them than Jay Bigsy. Wait, wait, wait! It work. It work. Yeah, Wait, it's working. We, something's we, leaking. Something's we're leaking. Up, we're up to something else up there. All right. Well, these bla I need to get out of this room before I blow a few. Oh, oh my down. God. I'm going to kill somebody. <laughs> was that you, Vems? No, no. You just knocked me no, off, no, no, didn't no. you? No, no, no. Trust me. That wasn't me. Vems, dude. I am not. These blazes put me in a bad mood, dude. I'm freaking climbing. Okay. Back off, man. Oh, jeez. Touch me again, Vems. Touch me again. I dare you. Get over here. Touch him. Get over here. Dare you to touch me again, dude. Dare you. How's that feel, buddy? How's that taste, Vams? <laughs> what? What taste? Nice, man. You stay in there. Touch me again, dude. Oh, I dude. will. Oh, my. <laughs> We're in the IG room. All right, I'm coming up now. Oh, there's IGs, too. This place is rich. All right, truce, Vams. Truce. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if we'll get Jay Big Z. Is he still? Oh, is he in that I box? I can't believe he's going to get away. Oh, that's <laughs> he's in a little obby box. It's like he knew and you were coming. Like, oh man. We are inches away from him. <laughs> oh. I don't think we'll get him. Oh, there's a glitch room. There could be a chance. Um, if I could hit a god dang it. Babs, <laughs> Babs, you're getting on my bad side. You really are. No, I'm not done with him yet. Me... I'm oh, not like, done with him. I could tunnel, I could right tunnel more down below, sand stack again, and then go up in the base again. Holy oh god. god, he wants this guy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm not done with him. <laughs> I can't get these spawners, guys, with creep rags or anything. So, as for the raiding portion, I'll check for more chests. This was a really good raid, though. I will check for a few more chests, but we got a nice amount of loot. This is just iron golems. Actually, in here might be some stuff. Oh, here we go. I found the goods. Thank you. Napkin, dude, you actually did it. 
<laughs> took so, him a half hour, but... Yeah, so he stacked that sand right there while and Vems and I have just been messing around. And, yeah, you actually got it. I was just up here. He's open. I'm going to leave him for you. Get your strength oh, and yeah. speed, though, because sometimes Why? people are watching a movie or something and they hear themselves getting hit. Well, right? if he hasn't heard this much, then... I guess, yeah, he's probably sleeping. But, yeah, it's open right on the side. He's staring at me. Wild, he's got your skin on. <laughs> Wait, a, what? Now I really want to kill Napkin, Whoa. dude. Napkin. Oh, he's pumped. Napkin's pumped. Here he goes. 77, 73, will he come back? 60, 40. Now can get ready to have a squealy moment. Get excited, dude. 18, squealy. 3, <laughs> 8. What are you going to do, dude? What are you going to do? 4. Don't kill him. You're ta I, oh, I almost Gone. took it. There it is. That would have been mean. J. Big Z <laughs> was death banned by Napkin of Truth, dude. The ultimate goal. Napkin, good job today, dude. You put a lot of work into this one. Mems is back after I slaughtered them both earlier. <laughs> hitting us. Okay, oh, yeah. maybe I you didn't actually slaughter. The... Yeah, truce, Mems, truce. And at the end of everything, J. Big Z and their group of t trash talkers that said some very mean things to Napkin, this is what their base looks like. <laughs> Split bottom to top, not once, but twice, <laughs> because Napkin wanted to kill the guy who was AFK. <laughs> exactly. that is, that's just brutal. Guys, we will do today's goodbye in the beautiful Goliath V4. If you're excited for the final leg, basically the final 20 episodes of this season of the show, and also excited for the best season of factions, which will be coming up next season. You know, after this, this, this season's been the best, of course. Every next season is always the best. We've got something so unique coming for you. I'm scared to do it. You guys should be scared to watch it, but excited. There's going to be so many different things mechanic-wise within the factions world that's going to change the the story of this show and how it runs drastically. So prepare yourselves. Make sure to tune in every single episode these next three weeks because you won't want to miss anything. Some big things are going down. Now, I'm glad to have you back, dude. The Goliath V4 is beautiful. If you all enjoyed today, touch that like button. Join the rushers by subscribing. Recent five donors to the Archon. Verdict X, Hazak 129, Iron Man's Heart, Lachlan 3G, and Raging Wolf 1. Thank you for your purchases, the Archon. Enjoy your ranks, your miscellaneous items, your tags. We have a really cool couple tags coming to you this weekend. I'll let you know about those tomorrow's episode. And, uh, yeah, you're all beautiful. I should probably hit a good old crate key. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. What are we going to do? Normal crate key today. Drop out some iron. $20,000. Woohoo! That's a pretty good win on a normal crate key. I will take it. It's very late at night. I cannot freak out. But with that, we will see you all tomorrow. Same time, same place. You're all beautiful. Have a beautiful one. We'll talk to y'all later. Goodbye.